Hey, hey, Blue Table fans. We're here looking at a Forge World Winged Hive Tyrant. Way back in the day, it used to be that you would need to purchase this model from Forge World to get a Winged Hive Tyrant. Uh, just wanted to give this a 360. The wings are really quite broad. In fact, I think they're butting up against the backdrop here. There we go. So they're really, the wings are very impressive on this. He's probably got pushing a 12 inch wingspan here from tip to tip. And as you can see, it's done in uh, quite a few earth tones. The only unnatural tone here is the blue, obviously. And, uh, you know, we've been seeing a lot of this recently, of uh, blue and green Tyranids, and I think people see it, they love it. Uh, if you look at the base, it's got this really cool decorative base down here. Uh, this water is uh, really quite, quite natural looking. I mean, it's a... Uh, I don't know, dare I say very fluid. Now you can't see it, but this model's actually magnetized, but only one option per point. Uh, the gun here magnetizes on the head. I can actually show you that one. So the head will uh, swivel just a little bit, just for kicks. And uh, that's also for ease of storage. Uh, obviously, uh, very Geiger-esque. If you look at the early Tyranids, they, um, I mean, it's obvious it has that influence. So uh, let's take a look at the wings here. And, <clears throat> so this is a current Hive Tyrant wing, so uh, if you actually hold that up against it, it is, it is a tad smaller, which I like, which I like, I think that's a, I think that's a good thing, um, <clears throat> his, well, with a whip crack, with his whippy tail. So this is a regular Demon Prince's wings, and uh, so I just went downstairs and picked that up. And, uh, and, you know, it, it used to be that's what you would put on Winged Hive Tyrants to make that conversion. Well, anyway, I saw this guy. I thought he was, thought he was pretty cool, pretty camp. I think this guy's holding his own. I love it that he's got this elevated leg there that makes it look like he's running. So uh, very lithe, the oversized head, very Geiger-esque. And uh, this model certainly holds its own with uh, anything that's been being published currently.